Hello guys, welcome back to Sholiver Celebrity News and Updates where we bring you the right update and all of what you will like to know. If you are new here or if at all you are just passing by for the first time, please take some minutes of your time to subscribe, like, comment and hit the notification button so that you will not miss in any of my uploads. Iga Swiatek has been one of the most unmistakable players in the past two seasons. Swiatek finished the season as world number one, after winning the WTA Tour Finals. She was ousted from her position by Irina Sabalenka, due to the clean aces destitute shape in the middle of the season. In any case, after a return to create in the WTA Tour and the China Open, Swiatek sublimely finished the year at top. After a fruitful 2023 season, Swiatek wrapped up the season as the highest paid female athletes, with a whopping $23.9 million in profit as per Forbes. She has beaten Coco Gauff and Irina Sabalenka to this accomplishment. Coco Gauff is in the third position now with $21.7 million, while Sabalenka is in sixth position with $14.7 million. Coco Gauff and Sabalenka as well have had a really imposing 2023 season, with both of them winning a major Grand Slam each. Sabalenka won the 2023 Australian Open, while, on the other hand, Gauff won the 2023 US Open. Emma Raducanu and Naomi Osaka, even after lost nearly the whole season, hold fourth and fifth positions in the list, with $15.2 million and $15 million. Iga Swiatek won the French Open at Roland Garros in the season and went on to win the WTA Tour Finals. In the finals of the WTA Tour, Swiatek crushed Jessica Pegula in straight sets after beating Sabalenka in the semis. Other than that, Swiatek too won the Poland Open, as well as the China Open. The 22-year-old too come to the quarterfinals of the Wimbledon. However, the 2023 season didn't guarantee a smooth run for her. She was ousted from her world number one position by Irina Sabalenka in the middle of the year. As, in that period, Swiatek's destitute run of shape saw her get early ends from various tournaments. The 2022 US Open winner had a destitute run this time around down below, losing out to Jelena Ostapenko in the round of 16 of the tournament. Swiatek moreover lost to Coco Gauff in the semi-finals of the Cincinnati Experts. In a head-to-head -head circumstance, Swiatek includes a predominant record against both of them. In any case, Sabalenko and Gauff have given Swiatek an extreme time in the past and will without a doubt be her first threats in the upcoming season, beginning with the Australian Open. Swiatek didn't had a really good time last time in Melbourne Park, and hence she will need to make a solid statement next time. In any case, for that, she will without a doubt got to bolt horns with the defending champion. Thank you for watching to the end, if you have something to tell us about this video leave your comment on the comment section below. Your comments matters a lot. Don't forget to subscribe, like this video and share. See you next time.